time for some showbiz now, and Kem is here with some very exciting Love Island news. I knew you'd be very excited so about excited. it. Love Island's coming back, and we saw a little video on, for the first thing we saw, we saw Caroline Flack's video on her Instagram. Let's have a look at this. She's been doing the promo, so this is what she said. Okay. What's really exciting about this week is, this week we start filming for Love Island 2019, and by the end of the week, I'm gonna have potentially have seen the cast for this year, which is really exciting. Um, I'm mad that it's come around this quick. So we now know it. why she was filming. She was filming the promo. Yeah. So she will see kind of all the cast before any of us do. But it's mad, like, to think two years ago, this was me getting ready. Yeah. To so go how in. does it work then? Once you know that you've got the gig, are you in hiding? Yeah, you, so... How long before we see you? Do you find out? How's it work? I knew really early. I knew about eight weeks before the show started. So I was, like, training, getting ready, dieting and stuff. But some, like, Chris, I, he said he watched the first episode of me on it and then he flew out the next day and went straight in. He didn't no. have a clue. And, like, I was in hiding hiding for two weeks, no phone, no TV, no newspapers, nothing. And we was in like a little village where no one could speak English. You like a German bit. I was so, I was confused what was going on. I didn't have a clue what, what I was about to go into. But it is really weird that you get pulled away mm. from kind of your whole life because it's become such a huge show that if people see the press release mm. and they see you on the street, they want to come over to but you. But you don't see Caroline, you don't see the other contestants, you're kept away from absolutely yeah, everyone. And I assume your phone is taken away. Yeah, you know, 100%. that's it. You're nice. And um, they also bring more than the original cast out. They, they change it up every day. You could go, like I remember, Amber wasn't meant to go in at the beginning and they changed it last minute and she went in. Like They will literally just decide as you're out there who they think kind of fits it at the time and it is just oh. mad and I think everyone's summer is ready to get taken over. Oh, so you have to, wait. I'm assuming you have to do an audition? Yeah, you have to do, you, I went for about four or five actually, you do, a, you? You do a few videos. I think we might have one. I know what's coming. Here we go. <laughs> right. If I could describe myself in three words, it would be sexy, cheeky and naughty. My ex-girlfriends would probably describe me as very lovey and affectionate probably a little bit clingy, but very funny. What cocktail would I be? Strawberry mojito all day, because it's sweet, nice colour, and normally it's probably one of the more expensive ones on the menu. Ah, uh, uh, are you still a strawberry mojito? <laughs> I'm actually rather a porn star martini. <laughs> oh, well, <laughs> I've, I've, I've upgraded, I've upgraded, I prefer that, but I, I feel like a different person there. Don't, well, I've, you are in a I've way. I've grown you up like about eight years in the last two years, but yeah. uh, no, it's nice to look back, I know. I feel a little bit cringe there, but if I if I didn't do that, I would have Nothing to cringe about, seriously. No, no so time. sweet. When's your birthday? Uh, tomorrow. Ah, uh, right. how old are you 20, tomorrow? 23, I'm yeah. getting 23. old, guys. Oh, no. Right, right. in comes the cake. Oh, no! Look there at you are. that! Oh, God, I've got to get emotional. How cool is that cake? How's that? You've got Rocky on it and everything. That's we'll uh, we'll go into, we'll just have a look at your cake whilst we've got this message, uh, because it's from Chris. Here you go. Broski, what's happening? I've never, ever done a landscape video before, so you should feel very honoured. But I just want to say, apologies for the traffic, happy birthday for tomorrow. Hope you love your cake that you've received today. And I'm actually going to be at your house in a few hours' time, so get home, save it sound. I'll see you on the flip side, and love ya. Oh, this, uh, is, this, is, this is my favourite job I've ever had, guys. I feel a bit emotional. Have a look at, come and have a look at your cake. Here you it's go. It's such here a go, cool cake. Go, so you've oh. got Love Island at the bottom. You've got the cast of Mamma Mia behind you. What? There we are. Oh my God, it's amazing. Have, I'll cut you a little. I'll cut you a little. Oh, a diet fill. No, I'll cut oh, you a you tiny. Oh, you've got to eat your own so birthday. So Stork that have made this. So thank you to thank them. Thank you, Stork. There we are. I'm just going to cut you a tiny slice. Okay. Well, you've been a bit stingy with that, I one, haven't you? Been a bit stingy, but nevertheless, there you go. You got most of the icing there. Thank you, mate. Okay. Oh, wow. There you are. Cheers, guys. Happy Happy birthday. Birthday. Thank you. All right, you're welcome. And you can cut me a piece of cake, please. Of course, I will. Thank, Thank you very much.